I've been waiting for this day for 20 weeks. I'm going to make a Snickers protein shake. Honestly, you guys, interior design is so hard. I'm back home, so I'll quickly show you what I got. Good morning, you guys. Welcome to a new vlog. I'm so excited for today. I can't wait to show you what I'm doing. I've been waiting for this day for 20 weeks literally 20 weeks so you can probably imagine my excitement but i'll explain it in a second but first i'm going to make a protein shake because i need something to tie me over between breakfast and lunch you know what guys i love making an actual protein smoothie so usually i just grab my protein powder add some water or some milk and then shake it up drink it good to go but I feel like if you take time for things and if you really put in a little bit of extra effort and then make the little moments so much more enjoyable, you'll get so many little happy moments in your day, honestly. I'm going to make a Snickers protein shake. For that, I'm using a bunch of different ingredients. I'm just going to go by whatever I feel like doing. We'll just see how it goes. I have this chocolate coconut protein powder that I'm going to add and then I'm going to add some actual cacao powder. Oof, it's packaging. <laughs> then I'm going to add some peanut butter and then I made these little date snacks with peanut butter and peanuts. So I'm just going to add two of those. And I'll save this for Loie, because she loves peanut butter. And then I'm just going to blend it up. I don't have ice, so I'm hoping it will be a bit creamy, but we'll see. And I'm just using my Nutri Bullets. Okay, so I have this sugar-free syrup. My sweater is a little messy. This sugar-free syrup, like a chocolate syrup. So I'm going to drizzle that around the glass. So, and then I'm going to add my shake. Okay, so it's definitely not creamy, but it's fine. It will taste the same. Okay, taste this. And that is so nice. A little bit of extra effort, a little bit of extra time, if you can. Makes your day 10 times better. Okay, so a before, this was the temporary couch that we had. So we had our beige couch in the other apartment. You've probably seen it in my other videos as well. I had this big beige couch, which was lovely, and we really wanted to keep it here for the time being, but it didn't fit the elevator. So we had a temporary solution, and this is actually just part of a couch. I'm really excited to get a full couch again. As you can see, this is like one half, and then this was supposed to be a long part as well, but that didn't fit the elevator either. And then this is the before of the table. I love this table, but I don't love the wood on wood. And also this table is quite bulky, as you can see. So I'm really excited for the new table that we are going to get. And also we didn't have chairs. So I am really excited to get chairs. But also the table is super heavy, so we need to disensemble. Is that how you say it? I don't know. We need to take it apart together and then that's why we have the blankets on the floor because we don't want to mess up the floor. And then I'm going to show you another little corner, which is actually behind me. And we'll get a big cabin. I think that's the word. We get a big cabin there, which will be nice because now our kitchen is fully crammed with like the air fryer and, and all the plates and, and I want to get more like cute little glasses and stuff, but I don't have room. So it would be great to have that cabinet kind of as an extension of the kitchen so we can just put the air fryer in there and the blender and you can just easily grab it. So there will be a big black cabinet here, which will be nice. I don't know the word. I don't think it's cabinet, but whatever. And then we will get a new TV thingy as well. Because this one is from the old apartment. But the vibe, the vibe from this apartment is completely different. So in the other apartment, it was more like bright and white. And here we wanted to have a little bit more of like darker items. Get a bit more of like a cozy vibe going. So the TV 
thing will actually be like golden-ish. I don't know if I love it anymore because as I said it's been 20 weeks since we picked out the furniture and 20 weeks is quite a long time so now I'm thinking like I don't know how it will look like the golden we'll see and everything is a mess now so I'm excited to get this over and done with and then we can finally enjoy our apartment as it was meant to be because also I've been waiting with buying like the core stuff before we got our actual furniture because I was like you need to feel the vibe and see how everything looks together I'm going to do it straight after they brought the furniture I think I'm going to go to Zara home because I love Zara home and then pick up some like, cute decor stuff so I'll take you guys along with me and I'll probably ask my spam account to pick things for me because I am not really a good interior designer at all so I need all the help that I can get Everything is gone. We're just waiting for the people to arrive with the furniture. But in the meantime, so the reason why I'm still wearing this shirt for like two days while it's gross because I've trained in it is because I got a package and I think it has loungewear, which I'm really excited for. We do a little unboxing. We're doing an unboxing. Let's see what we got. Alrighty. Nice. Nice. Oh, okay, first outfit, I have this little cami top, I think that's what you call it, in black, really cute. And then I have these leggings, kind of. They're like the Pulse collection, I believe. They're super stretchy, super comfy, and they have a little flare at the bottom, which I always love. And I also have a really cute long sleeve that I'll try on now. Okay, so I'm in the middle of my hall, and I just got a call that the guys are here. So now I have clothes everywhere, and I'm trying to get downstairs real quick, because Ruben isn't here. What a mess, what a drama. I'll clean my clothes up, otherwise it looks a bit random, because everything is on the floor now, thanks to Chloe. I mean, perfect. Okay, leave it. Okay, we got the furniture, but I'm really hungry. So I quickly got a poke bowl. So I made this poke bowl with rice as a base. And then I added avocado, cucumber, mango, edamame, fried shrimp. I just put my finger in it. And then I have chiracha mayo, fried onion, and sesame seeds. This is like my go-to favorite Poke Bowl variation. I finished eating and I quickly wanted to show you the long sleeve top that I was going to show you before the furniture arrived. This is a little sneak peek by the way, but I'm first going to go decor shopping and then I'll show you like the end result after. But first my shirt, so it's like a long sleeve with a little v-neck, very cute, but then the back. I love the back. So nice. So I'll leave my shopping link in the description box down below if you want to go ahead and check it out. And then I'm quickly going to go to the shops because they will close in one hour. So I gotta be quick. I just pulled up at the store. I have 20 minutes before it closes, so I have to be really quick because it's a big store and I'm very excited. I don't know anything about interior design, so I probably need your help, but let's go and see if we can find some cute things. Okay, I love this. How cute is this little chair? And then with this wooden block and this, I can already see it. And with a lamp even, we don't have a lamp. And this kind of looks like our couch color, so. I just don't know where to put it, but it's a vibe. I love it. Oh, this is fake flower heaven. I feel like I'm shopping with you guys, but I don't know if fake flowers is allowed, but I love it. Like how pretty are these? I think this is dry. It's not necessarily fake. Hmm. Let me know in the comments what we think about fake flowers. Ooh. I love these like natural cups. Okay, I don't need this. I don't think these fit our house, but I love these. Could be really pretty. Honestly, you guys, interior design is so hard. The 
only reason we were able to get an apartment with furniture that kind of matches is because the girl in the store was like super good at it and she basically <laughs> picked out everything for us. I think it's so difficult, especially when you see like a room that you love and you'll be like, okay, I'll get like all the items. But because your room looks different, it will look and feel completely different. Oh, this is really weird. I thought this was glass. It's plastic. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I think this is so cute as well. It's my dream to have like a big clothing room and then have one of these in the middle. Here you have my fake flowers again. Look how cute they are. In a vase like this, I'm, I'm filming this for future reference because I think this is cute. This is the prettiest stuff ever. Or these ones. This is so pretty. I love this as well. It's so nice. I don't know where to put it. Like, where does this go? Okay, I think I need this. Like, how cute is this? This is an actual plant, I think. I don't know how expensive it is. It looks, <laughs> looks quite expensive. Let me see. Oh, it doesn't have a price tag. That's usually not a good sign. Oh, this one is 20. Oh, it's here. 195. This is like a stone. That's really cute, though. Anyways, what I was trying to say is that if you're ever looking for nice candles, and I think nice candles is like the perfect gift, but get the wood wick ones because they crackle as they burn. Oh, they're so nice and the scents are really nice as well. Just a tip, but I already have them, so I don't need more at the moment. I love this one as well. I think it's real. Yes, that looks like a real plant. Wait, I love this one as well. I don't know if they're indoor plants though. Okay, so I'm back. I didn't get anything. I did get some inspiration, but I'm I'm not an interior designer, so I'll ask by myself if you guys like what like the first option or the second options. If you don't follow me there, please follow because it's like my lifeline. But second of all, I think we'll just go back to the store and let the girl help us with styling. She was really excited for it, so that will be fun. I am going back home and show you the new furniture. Okay, I'm going to show you the after. The new couch. Do you love it? I love that it looks like it's like Binnester buiten. We obviously still need to get like pillows, but as I said, we haven't done the styling yet. And then with these ones, I love that the colors like it all comes together, you know what I mean? Like the colors of the couch are in these little tables and stuff, very cute. There are still a few things missing, apparently. Uh, one of them is the TV cabinet, so I'll update you in a future vlog. And then you can see here, we have the big cabinet. I don't know the word, but it's here and I love it. It's like brown black and it has like a touch closure thing so it's super nice and then the table which is a stone table with these brown details we didn't actually know what the table would look like exactly but I'm really happy with how it turned out and then we have these green velvety chairs these ones so yeah we can finally sit which will be nice Hey everyone, it is a few days later and I'm now going to Zara home to see if I can pick up some items. I really want to get some pillows for the couch because my previous trip wasn't successful and I really wanted to. what I got from Zara home. So I didn't get any pillows because they, they only had like pillows for your bed and that wasn't really what I was looking for. But I did get some other really cute stuff. First one is this bottle. So I always use um, vinegar to clean with and then I can make it 
like save the mixture in here, I guess. And then I do half vinegar, half water. Works perfectly. Then I picked up these ones. I have four of them for when you're drinking tea. They're super lightweight and thin. I got four of these ones as well, which are super thin as well. As well? As well. And then I also got four of these ones, which are really thin, love them. And I got a matching. I always struggle with drinking enough water, so I thought if I get one of these, then I can fill it up with water during dinner and then just make sure that I drink more. Hopefully it works, I don't know. But it's the same style as the glass I showed before. I got some other bits for whenever we are shooting more recipes, which is Monday and Tuesday actually. So I got some napkins in different colors and then, then I got one a cutlery set. I think it's really pretty and what I love is whenever you're photographing it, you don't see like the camera in the reflection, so that's great. So that's everything I got. Unfortunately, no accessories for the living room, for the couch or anything. But I'll keep you updated in my future vlogs if I get something. Thank you so much for watching and then I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys. Pak wel even een volgende. Beetje.